Thank you very much for this uh, interview, Mr. Rinaldi. Uh, let's talk about CRT. Which parameters should we consider for best outcome results for uh, 2016? Okay. Um, well, thank you for the question. Um, as we know, CRT is a very effective treatment, but uh, approximately a third of patients don't derive benefits. So, in terms of the parameters that we need to look at, are those parameters that are going to improve patient outcomes? So, I think we can look firstly at patient selection. But also, I think importantly, we can look at how we actually deliver the therapy in terms of targeting left ventricular lead placement, which is of particular interest of ours in London, either using hemodynamic or MRI guidance. And I think there's no increase in evidence if you can actually place the left ventricular lead to the optimal position, then you may actually improve the outcome of our patients. So, do, uh, do you target um, best groups of uh, patients uh, for CRTs? Well, we, we adhere to the guidelines, the European guidelines, in terms of implantation of the patients, but the patients then that are undergoing the treatment, we will try all, all the technologies that we have to hand to try to improve the outcome in, in that patient group. And what kind of technologies, what do we have uh, updated for the technologies for this? Well, I mean, a lot of the technologies are related to image guidance, so there's echocardiographic guidance, but of particular interest to us is using uh, cardiac MRI imaging, to locate areas of, of both scar and late electrical activation to so actually place the lead into those areas and using novel technologies we can actually take those MRI images and, and actually fuse them at the time of implantation onto x-ray images to actually guide us to the optimal position.